Alex Rogan lives in a small trailer park in the California mountains. He has a dream to go to college. You guys think I'm going to hang out here, watch you shine your pickup? Forget it, man. I'm doing something with my life. Start a career. You really are leaving here, aren't you? Of course I'm going away. We're both going away. Both of us, Alex. And most of all, to get out. You get your chance. The important thing is when it comes, you got to grab it with both hands. Then, one night, a mysterious stranger offers Alex an opportunity he never dreamed of. Who are you? I'm Centauri, and you may... No, you must trust me implicitly. Get in. Nothing Alex Rogan has ever imagined could prepare him for what he is about to experience. Ah. Hey. Why was Alex chosen? And will he ever return? Where are we going? Trust me. Oh, oh, oh you're going to love it. Love it. Look out. Oh, dear. The last starfighter. His adventure in space is about to begin. In the 21st century, a weapon will be invented like no other. This weapon will be powerful, versatile, and indestructible. It can't be reasoned with. It can't be bargained with. It will feel no pity, no remorse, no pain, no fear. It will have only one purpose to return to the present and prevent the future. This weapon will be called the Terminator. You're dead, honey. What day is it? The date? 12th, May, Thursday. What year? Assigned to protect you. You've been targeted for termination. Why does it want me? Why me? Arnold Schwarzenegger is the Terminator. Your future is in its hands.
because we live here. Not bad for a bunch of kids, huh? Mama would be real proud. Warm, you lied to me. You said she was a city girl, out of her element. Just get her in the map and bring them back. Piece of cake, piece of cake, my butt. What went wrong? I'll tell you what went wrong. First of all, guess who else is here? You're dead right, Solo. What? Secondly, she's got herself a partner. Who likes shooting holes and everything. The minimum price for taking a stranded woman to a telephone. It's $400. 375 in traveler's checks? Not a deal. That's just the beginning of what's going on down here. that'll make you go back into that hellhole. Don't bring that up, Ira. Ira, stop it! <laughs> All right, I'll go back. But this time... You're coming with me. Come to laugh. Would you like to come in? I'd rather stick needles in my eyes. Come to care. <laughs> Oh, well, that's the first time I stopped hugging first. <laughs> Come to terms. Do you have any reaction at all to my telling you I love you? I was just inches from a clean getaway. Deborah Winger, Shirley MacLaine, and Jack Nicholson. Terms of Endearment. All that they've loved. All that they've fought for. All that they've stood for will now be put to the test. Star Trek Three: The Search for Spock. The word, sir? The word? Is no. I am therefore going anyway. You do this, you'll never sit in the captain's chair again. Engage auto systems. Clear all moorings. Cleared, sir. One quarter impulse power. Someone is stealing the Enterprise. Warp speed. Think I'll burn a bracer. She's arming torpedoes. Shields up. The shield's not the response. Fuck! We're a sitting duck. Join us on this, the final voyage of the Starship Enterprise. Star Trek III, the search for Spock. The adventure continues. is a Detroit cop <laughs> on vacation in Beverly Hills. I just got off the phone with an Inspector Todd in Detroit. He says if you're out here investigating the Tandino murder, you needn't bother coming back. I don't want to take it anymore. A man who claims to be on vacation, you look a lot like you're on a stakeout. Stakeout? No, no. I'm picnicking. This is like a picnic area. I have to ask you some questions about Michael Tandino. I never been to a cell that had a phone in it. Can I stay for a while? Because I ordered some pizza. We have six witnesses that say you broke in and started tearing up the place, then jumped out the window. May I help you? Yeah. I'm looking for Victor Meadland. I have nothing to say to you. You just got 
your badges and your guns and you're on the job, right? Make sure we get the right drinks, because if I drink club soda, I'll throw up. You know, this is the cleanest and nicest police car I've ever been in in my life. This thing's nice in my apartment. Not just rich, you are the pride of your department in Detroit. <laughs> Seems painfully obvious you haven't the slightest idea who you're dealing with. I don't know what y'all think I am, killing some kind of fool. Hurry up, quicker! Crawl back to your little stone in Detroit before you get squashed. Eddie Murphy, Beverly Hills Cop. <laughs> He's the new kid in town, and the music's on his side. Pictures presents Footloose. Crime. The city was full of it. Hey! Three TVs! Desperate measures were needed. I want you to go to the police academy. The police academy is such a dangerous place. Honey, don't worry. Desperate measures were taken. I'm joining the police force! The mayor says we have to take this riffraff. I'm trapped here? Oh, yes. We all are. What about guns? When do we get guns? You will be schooled in firearms, police procedures, local laws, and many, many other things. High speed driving. <laughs> Police Academy. Where did you get this gun? Mom gave it to me. Mister, I am warning you, hot tower! They're lean. Mean. Does the radio bother you? I can turn it down. Obscene. Each and every one of them striving to defend. You make me sick. Thank you, sir. I make everybody sick. Let's see the thighs. Or upend. Come on, come on. I haven't got all day the thighs. And now that they're ready for the real world. Give me the thing! Crime is no longer the number one problem. They are. Can you get my kitty cat out of the tree? No problem, ma'am. Police Academy. This is it. 
This is the end of the line. You're telling me. Did I tell you about the pool here? For Daniel LaRusso. Is this the only pool you guys got? The future seemed far from terrific. This place is a dump. You should go back to New Jersey. Hey, I know it's hard, but we're not quitters, are we? Until I... he met the hey, right girl. I I. She's beautiful. I say she's beautiful. I think she's beautiful. Is that your address? You got it. But that it. only angered the wrong guy. Definitely. You gotta be nuts. And his troubles really began. You had to push it. Now you can pay. Then, in one man, he found a teacher. I promise teach karate. And a friend. Fighting always last answer. How did you do that? Don't know. First time. Power. Whole body. Yeah. Make a perfect picture. How do I know if my picture's the right one? If come from inside of you, always right on. Lesson about the balance, not just karate. Lesson for all life. Why drink? So I won't have to fight. Hey, karate kid, let's take a move. <laughs> no points or no points. You're dead meat. I don't have much of a cheering section. You got me. In the end, it will be in Daniel's hands. In his body. And most of all, in his mind. Concentrate, focus, power. Remember, balance. No mercy. Columbia Pictures presents The Karate Kid. Hey, what kind of belt do you have? Canvas. You like <laughs> J.C. Penny, 398. <laughs> Steven Spielberg presents Gremlins. Billy Pelser has a nice home. Billy, is that you? Yeah, Ma, it's me. A nice job. A nice girl. If you're not doing anything this Thursday night, maybe you'd like to uh, go out on a date with me? I'd love to. And loving parents who are about to give him... You're gonna like this. No, 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 don't shake it. We're gonna have to open it now. It won't wait till Christmas. The most unusual gift he ever got. What is it? No. It's your new pet. Come on, Barney, be a good dog. My dad gave it to me. But there are a few things to keep in mind. If you expose it to the light, you may hurt it. If you get it wet, it will multiply. All that from water? They got wet? Yeah, plain water. And most important, no matter how much they beg, never, never let them eat after midnight. Because when they do, they change. They become clever. Mischievous. Here. And dangerous. Gremlins, huh? Little monsters. Right. Hundreds of them. Well, I, I don't know, maybe thousands. They've been here too. Billy, what are these things? Where do they come from? Look, I know it sounds crazy, I know. But in a few hours, you're gonna have a major disaster on your hands. Directed by Joe Dante. They'll be expecting you. If adventure has a name, it must be Indiana Jones. From Steven Spielberg and George Lucas. Indiana Jones. And the Temple of Doom. You don't believe me. You will, Dr. Jones.
ghosts. Hello, Ghostbusters. They're real. You do? You have? They're here. <laughs> Ghostbusters. Hey, anybody see a ghost? They catch the ghost that won't stay dead. They're armed. <laughs> They're dangerous. Try to imagine all life as you know it stopping instantaneously and every molecule in your body exploding at the speed of light. All right, that's bad. Okay. All right, important safety tip. Thanks, Egon. They're professionals. Oh, I'm the chairman of the largest paranormal removal company in America. Did you see it? They're all that stands between you and the end of the world. The city is headed for a disaster of biblical proportion. Real wrath of God type stuff. Exactly. Fire and brimstone coming down from the sky. Human sacrifice, dogs and cats living together, mass hysteria. Your girlfriend lives in the corner penthouse of Spook Central. You want this body? Is this a trick question? Got your stick? Hold! Beat him up! Smoke him! Make him hard! Ready! Ghostbusters. Starring Bill Murray, Dan Aykroyd, Sigourney Weaver, Harold Ramis, Rick Moranis. Coming to save the world. Who you gonna call? Ghostbusters. <laughs>